what are some of the things dentists should look for when we're comparing malpractice insurance? The financial strength and health of the carrier is really important and something they should evaluate when they're making a buying decision. What that's really going to show them is that the carrier is going to be able to A, be around for the long haul over the course of their career, and B, have the financial resources to pay out a lot of money in the defense of their claims and be really aggressive there. So that makes sense. I, I, we want them to be financially strong, but how can I tell? So there's third party independent rating agencies that evaluate the financial health and strength of all insurance carriers, even specific to malpractice. I mean, those are AM Best and Standard & Poor's. They take a look at the carrier's balance sheets, um, the amount of money they have behind them, and then they give them ratings uh, to evaluate that. At MedPro, for instance, we have an A++ financial strength rating of AM Best, and that's the strongest in the industry. Outside of the third-party ratings, are there other ways I can tell if a carrier has the ability to defend me when I need to be defended? So one thing you want to look for with the carrier that you ultimately buy your policy from is that they pay for defense costs outside of the policy limits. So there's a lot of different expenses that come into play when managing and defending a malpractice lawsuit. Things like getting expert witness support, um, putting expert witnesses in hotels, paying for food, paying those attorneys to defend your case, all those things you're going to want to be outside of the policy limits because you don't want them to drain your own individual limits down. So I've heard of malpractice carriers and even other insurance carriers kind of offering the gamut of insurance, but this is a pretty specialized area. So what would you recommend? So I can see where it would be convenient to be able to get all those different insurance products from one carrier. One thing I would argue with that is that the defense of a malpractice lawsuit, especially within healthcare, is so concentrated and focused being with a carrier that truly understands that niche and that's what they're dedicated to and that's all they do on a day-to-day -day basis is going to benefit you in the long run. Yeah, it makes sense. I mean, I limit my dentistry to what I know best and I refer to specialists in all different areas to make sure my patients are always getting the very best they can get. So pretty helpful, Cam. Stability, important financially. We talked about expertise. It's a lot of great information. Thank you.